Hello guys, hello everyone. Today Olga with you and I'm talking about uh, legal changes in uh, Ukrainian law regarding Ukrainian citizenship. Many people um, I guess nowadays realize that Ukrainian citizenship is kind of valuable and uh, you need to appreciate that you have it if you have it and uh, uh, there was a public uh, demand you can say like that to make some kind of improvement to uh, the ways how a person can get citizenship, how he can qualify. And finally, a few days back, our government already enforced new law. It's already done. It's the final stage accepted and signed. And it will be effective in three months regarding changes how to obtain Ukrainian citizenship. So actually what changed? Uh, the reasons how you can obtain citizenship didn't really change, it all remained the same, but the procedure and what you need to do to obtain, to obtain citizenship is the one which got affected. So before it used to be that you need to uh, submit the document about um, education that you pass uh, language courses of Ukrainian language or later they also start asking uh, some people to make exam. Nowadays it is already final and everybody need to make exams, three exams actually, of Ukrainian language of Constitution of Ukraine and of Ukrainian history. Only after passing the three exams, a person can submit these papers together with all other papers and qualify to um, apply for Ukrainian citizenship. Before, some categories of Ukrainians used to be exempt from this exam. For example, it's about people whose immigration is a part of governmental interest or people who used to uh, work in um, Ukrainian military forces or some other categories, whatever. Anybody who didn't pass or was exempt from passing exam of Ukrainian language and he already obtained Ukrainian citizenship. Now, during these two years, he must pass all those three exams, Ukrainian language, history and constitution. And in case if these people will not pass this exam and they will not provide these documents to the um, governmental department, their citizenship will be cancelled. So even the one who got it recently and who didn't do this exam, he need to do it or he's in risk actually to lose Ukrainian citizenship. That is guys all changes according to Ukrainian law. So if you were targeting to get it or you were interested how to get Ukrainian citizenship, this is the exams which you for sure need to take. All other reasons and backgrounds based on what you can apply didn't change. So you can just check my previous videos where I was talking about that and write me questions in the comments if you have any. Thanks for watching this video. Bye bye.